Adamites, welcome to Sword and Sorcery. Super Brothers, Sword and Sorcery. My name is Tommy Dog. Uh, here we go. I can't remember if I can use this. I don't think I can. No, I can't. It's clicking the thingy. Hey, dude. That's Isn't that the, the, the Lich King? Uh, not the Lich King. He's doing some dance. Yay! This is episode two. This is session two as well. It's lovely to see you again. Are you ready to begin session two of SNS S and S EP? I am. Oh, that's us. Okay, so where were we? Oh, right. Now remember, you got a burdensome book known as the Megatome. That's right. Oh, yes, that's right too. The Deathless Spectre. You are the Deathless Spectre who still lurks in the darkness below, beneath the Mini Tor. What a creep, am I right? We did steal his book. He's probably got a right to be a bit annoyed. It is a time of woe. A sinister thunderstorm has clouded the skies, and the lovely people who live in the hut are miserable. It's kind of our fault, I think. Silencing the storm will require some familiarity with psionics, cryptozoology, and miracles. Uh oh, a swor Oh, it's oh yeah, it's sword and sorcery. So it's a sorcerer's touch will unseal the megatome, revealing the unspoken thoughts of living creatures and other esoteric material. I actually said that word right. I'm quite impressed. Strange sylvan sprites, sources, sources or sorcery, summer in ponds, woods, and meadows seek their subtle sonorous spumes. Oh, wow. A sorcerer who can locate, summon, and tame the cosmic geometry of the golden trigon will possess the ability to work miracles. Nice. Confused? Excellent. Keep calm and carry on. That was a lot of swasa and swasa swasa. Swasa swasa Ah, oh, this game is so cool. And there's my mouse. Oh, let's go. Can I, I can't remember what the zoom out was. Ah, the megatone. So we have to, ooh, wow, well, it's a little bit, ooh, a little bit, ooh, that's a bit glitchy there. Oh gosh. Okay, that was a little bit glitchy, I'm not gonna lie. So I think we have to find the uh Is that okay? I'm just checking in my, my recording screen. It was a little bit buggy, but it seems to be fixed now. I'm not sure why it's bugging a bit. Never mind. Um yeah. No, it's not bugging. Okay, cool. I can ignore that now. Oh, oh. I can't remember what the zoom out was. Oh, oh, look there, there, there. Oh, they said they resided in wells, didn't they? No, that is that is glitchy a bit. We spied something built. Yeah. Hmm. I th yeah, okay. So anyway, we're going to go back to the start and then work our way forward. Because we're supposed to be listening for... We're supposed to be looking for these sprites, these sylvan sprites. Oh, I just noticed. Was that? Oh, suppose you were sitting out in the meadow. I oh, know. I don't want to tweet that. what these things are. Oh, no, 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 don't want to quit. No, 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 no. Oh, what was that? That's something... Ooh! Ooh, what is this?
Was that? Did we get something? Wasn't sure if that did anything. So I guess we gotta look for the sprites. I guess they don't do anything. Never mind. Okay. Let's go talk to, um... Logman. So I wonder what these are. I wonder if I can get to these guys down here. No? Oh, log fell, that's right. Yep. Dude, I am well aware it was my fault that we, uh... Oh. It's you! It's time to learn the song Sorcery. Ah, cool. A consciousness expansion technique that reveals a mystical musical dimension. That's so cool. Keep calm and follow my direction to summon the sylvan sprite that softly slumbers in the cool waters of the deep water pond. Whew. Well, that says one. Tap and hold. Whoa. Oh, that's so cool. Where are you going? Oh, I didn't do it right. That's why. Oh, that's so cool. We sang a song of sorcery and summoned a slumbering sylvan sprite from the cool waters of a deep water pond. So strange. Bright moon in six days. Am I reading my thoughts? <laughs> you see the mega zone? Ah! Oh, that's cool. Dogfella A doesn't think of anything. Oh, that's so cool! Right, now I think we have to go back to the start. Okay, so let's do that. Oh, hello. Very nice to done. You've learned the song Sorcery. Now the unfathomable power of the Megatome is yours. Nice. The Megatome intercepts linguistic thoughts, transmission that contains everything you'll need to complete your woeful errand. Cool. I think that's something right at this moment. Why not open the Megatome? Oh. Look for a white triangle on the top right, tap it, and then equip the Megatome. Oh. I think I know what you were thinking, but never mind. Oh, that's amazing. That's so Good thing we have a huge, huge rock sack that we can fit that thing on. Hey, dog fella. You coming with me, boy? You coming with me? No? No? Okay, never mind. So, is there one in here? Oh, 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 no, there it is. There it is, there it is. Oh yeah, I gotta, I gotta tap and hold, down. I? Alright, so this must be number two. 
There we go. Boop. Okay, so one, two, three, four. Did I do that first time? I did that first time. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, listen to that sound. Oh, this game is so cool. <laughs> we just look at slumming someone's sprite from the rich earth of a meadow containing four pairs of worthless sheep. Yeah, sheep aren't worthless, all right? They... What's up, dude? Oh, we go back to read Dogfella's thoughts. Oh, nice. Dogfella, what you think? Bark, 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 bark. Cool, nice, nice, nice dog, Dogfella. Alright, buddy, let's, uh... Let's go, then. Oh, that's so cool. Normally this game would be about 15 minutes, but I might, um, it might be a bit longer, because obviously I'll, what I'll do is I'll cut to the, the sprites, so you don't have to see me, like, walking around a lot. Or oh, to be fair, that's kind of just a bit. Uh, it's just walking around a lot. Alright, dog fellow, what's up? Nothing? Okay. So I'm guessing we have to go uh, up through there. So let's go through there. Oh, there's one. Oh, how do I. Oh, we've got to be a bit closer. But you can't click on the, you can't click on the, um, oh, never mind, something's happening. Ready, dude? Oh, oh what's happening? Ah, there we go, I was just in the wrong place. Oh, so you've got to be quite near it. Oh, man, this game is so cool. Like I said, I'm so glad that my brother... Um, hey, there we go. Hey, little dude. Oh, I love that kind of music. Don't forget, you're gonna. We just woke a slumming silver sprite from a curious nest box surrounded by three rain soaked songbirds. It is our fault we, we brought a storm. I'm so sorry. What's happening? Where have you come from? What was that? Ooh! I've seen this. Oh, ooh, crikey. Um, how do I say that? Scythian? Scythian? I've seen the Scythian sing a song. Oh my days. <clears throat> I've seen the Scythian sing a song of sorcery and send three sylvan sprites skyward. I wonder if they'll help soothe the storm. They probably will. That was a lot of... No, I don't want to go down there just yet. Hang on. I want to... Just explore this way. Uh, I don't think... Yeah, there's nothing that way. Oh, this game's amazing. I keep saying that. I'm so sorry. I'll stop saying the game's amazing. But please, it's on Steam, so please go and check it out. Yeah, because this, this is part of the game 2 uh, that I uploaded about 8pm. It's been about 15 minutes already that I've been playing it. But, um... Oh, it's locked. The locked door on the stone wall blocks the old road to me, torn. Apparently the key is lost in dreams. We might actually then be near the end of this session. So actually, it's, it's around about the right time. Sup? The good... Oh, the good? I read the girl and stood together. The good... The girl stood sheltered from the rain beneath the broad wooden... The well. She had left the comfort of the hearth in the hut because apparently Logfair was freaking out about her, about something or other. Oh dear. Oh dear. What's wrong with Logfella? Let's go check it out. Let's go calm the dude. What's up, dude? What's, what's up, dude? 
come and share your words with us. The woeful woodsman known as Logfeller was totally freaking out about something. Apparently Logfeller had lost the key to the locked door in the stone wall that blocked the old road to Mingy Tor. Oh, that's not good. We were like, groan, but not a fetch quest, am I right? We were like, ugh, not another fetch quest, am I right? Logfeller told us he had been sitting right there by the fire when he had fallen into a deep sleep. Logfeller said he thought he had lost his key in the twilight realm of dreams. Oh, nice. We had heard about the strange dreams of the dark-haired mountain folk, the Caucasus. The Caucasus. The Cork I think it's Caucasus. 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 So this made perfect sense to us. Cool. Look for invited us to warm our boots by the fire and dream along with him. We will gladly like to. Happily. Boop. Oh, let's have a look at this guy first. The arch the archetype. Seek a warm hearth and allow sleep to come. Oh, nice. Oh, nuts. Where has my key gone? I'm so upset and ashamed now. I'm totally freaking out. Dude, the Atomite Pack are here. We will help you out, sir. Do not worry. Let's have a good old kip. Ah, oh, little Z's. Oh. I think that was the end of the session. I think it was. Oh, side B. That was the end of the session. Or was it? No, it... No, it wasn't. No, it was still in the... There's a dancing bear. Dude, that is cool. Don't hurt us though, please. Observe. Dream, observe. Oh, please tell me we get to see what the bear's thinking about. Oh no, it's a mountain folk, isn't it? I sure hope the dreamwalking Scythian can find my lost key. I lost on the sandy shore of a placid lake. Oh, bye, dude. Ah, oh, that's so cool. Oh, it's a deer. Oh, check out the deer. Oh, shoot. Oh, my bad. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Oh, hello. Why, hello there, sir. Who are you? In the security group, we met a mysterious fellow hanging out beside a crackling fire. Oh, okay. He's just, he's just chilling. He's playing his ukulele. That's cool. Hello, little dear. Sorry about that. I will stop trespassing in your domain right now. We had a deer in, our, in the garden once. Uh, it was like a few Christmases ago. It was so cool. It kind of scared the pants out of us because we were like, oh, there's a, there's a deer. I suck at dancing. Ugh. That's a mushroom. Oh, we better get a... I've had this little song in my head for ages. A little few minutes to loop over and over. I wonder what that's all about. Dude, it's a cool... It's cool. We'll see... Yeah, it's cool. Oh, there's another one. Why do I get the... F Hello, dear. Oh, you're the other dear. Why do I get the feeling these things are... impotent? Yeah. I oh, I think they regain our health. That might be why. I don't, I don't think I even want to use those just yet. Oh, there it is. There it is. Look at that. It's 2D, but it's so cool. Oh. Are we going back to the, the, the... Yes, we're going back to side A. I thought that whole dynamic was so cool. It's like side A is you're awake, side B when it flips. You go back to um, side B as the dream world. Perfect. I think I'm. I'm just. Ugh, I know I'm praising this game a lot, but it's just. It's just. It's just really cool. Ah, 
I got the key, dude. The woodsman was super relieved. Yeah. <laughs> we managed to achieve his lost key from the twilight realm of dreams. The woodsman known as Logfellow wondered how we got so smart and he asked about our woeful errand. Oh, you don't know. We told the woodsman how we would we had come of age on the step the steps alongside our fearless Scythian sisters and brothers. I hope that's how I say Scythian. We told Logfellow why we wandered here in this mountain wilderness and how we were guided by the finger of an all-knowing god. That's us. We told Logfellow about what we expected the esoteric mark inside the megatome might signify. We had a hunch that we needed some a few more sylvan sprites to soothe the storm. In hush whisper, we spoke of our intention to locate and tame a manifestation of cosmic geometry known as the Gold Trigon. <sighs> it was 100% clear the woodsman known as Logfellow had stopped paying attention. We figured we could just hang onto the key and go for a walk in the old road beyond the stone wall. Let's do it. Catch you later, log fella. Let's go, dog fella. I'm atomic dog fella. All right, so I'll I'll cut us back to when we get there. Through the power of magic, the megaturm magic. <laughs> oh shoot! I just noticed girls down there. Oh buggers! No, no. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Run away. I need you to move a little bit quicker, dude. Run, dude, run! Yeah, this one's probably going to be about half an hour. They say it takes like 15 to half an hour, so that's all right. We met the dark-haired girl standing... Dark-haired girl standing rain-soaked on a side path. She had heard the... Sun. Oh, cool. Towering tree trunks on the other side of a mighty river. Faint rainbows at the edge of the perilous precipice. Screw fear of told us to consult the Megatone, we became lost and confused. I know where we gotta go. So we gotta go to the two, the bridge, and then the precipice where we uh, went into the mouth where we stole the Megatone. Do we have to go back there? Is that a clever idea? I don't think it is. That dude's probably a little bit micked. Micked. I'm just mushing my words. A little bit ticked. I ain't fair to you. Ow! You douche! Yeah, that's right, boy. Oh, no, you don't. Yeah, come on. Go on. I dare you. No, I didn't, I didn't think you were gonna. You seem alright health-wise, actually. So that's pretty good. I wonder what that is. I wonder what that wolf is. Ah, here we go. There it is. There it is. Oh, I see it. So this is the first one. Whoop. Oh, I love that. Tap and hold on sorcery. Okay. Ah, here we go. I was a bit confused there. That one was a little bit confusing. I had nothing to do with swiping, tapping, or holding. We just woke a slumming silver sprite beside a stolid log bridge where four pairs of trees tower above a river. Oh, the mighty trees, of course. Oh, yeah. Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. They're, oh, they're magic mushrooms. Oh, whoops. Oh.
That says rub. Ah, there we go. It was, it was, it was rubbing. It was just <laughs> taking its time. Cool. I think that's the last sprite. We just woke a slumbering sylvan sprite between two lotan rainbows by the side of a perilous precipice. <laughs> that's a tongue twister. Whoa, what? The sheep in the meadow have taken fright. I wonder what's happening over there. Could be the gold trigon. Ooh, ooh. You know, whenever I feel the need, like I need to gather my strength, I just sit down beside this here hearth to warm my boots. Once you have begun a song of sorcery, you can ever so gently touch the edge of the screen to look around or use the arrow keys. Cool. However, the gold trigon. As you'll see, it's running about 35 minutes. Well, that's no, not. It's, it's about half an hour. But yeah, we're going to finish this, and then that's that out for this session. This session of amazement. Because they are, these, these, these sessions are cool. Are you alright, girl? How are you? We asked a girl about the worth of sheep hanging around at the hut, and she said they had taken fright a little while ago. I told the girl we sent five silver sprite sky, and she told us that perhaps the time of miracles was at hand. But maybe we ought to go investigate the meadow. Yeah, I thought I figured so. Here we go. Dip, 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 Scythian. I think it's Scythian. I think that's the right word, Scythian. Yeah, I think it's Scythian. Here we go, here we go. Oh, look at that. Ooh. Calm the storm. Look at little chickens laughs. Oh. I will I will have to be pick up that shroom. I hope it heals me and doesn't it's not tripping shroom tripping mushrooms. I'm guessing we have to click this bad boy. Did you honestly just punch yourself? I can't believe you just punched yourself. Why'd you do that? Oh. You feel that particular vibe? It's time to make a single sword. Oh, yeah, cool. Here we go. Stop punching yourself, man. That's so cool. Oh. What? Oh, that's amazing. Oh, the gold dragon. Oh yeah. Oh wow, look at the water. Uh, okay. Why are we fighting the gold trigon? Oh gosh, it's I just noticed what it's doing. Ah, I see. Oh, we gotta play pong with it. Is that enough? Did that do it? We're gonna harness the power of the gold trigon, and I got walloped a bit. Oh god, no. Oh. Oh, Jesus. 
No! Come on! I think that was it. Yes, the gold trigon is ours. Holy crud. Oh, wow. Oh. Now you're up. Yep. I guess this is like. Showing my master of the shield. Please say that's it. Oh, it's still going. Oh no. Oh, come on now. Oh, shizzle. I was already. Oh, what? No, come on. Oh, thank goodness. I think that's it. Oh, man. Oh, oh that's tough. Tell you what, that's where we'll leave it for this episode. That is, that's a bit of a tough one. And uh, I'm going to end it there because it's been about a bit longer than half an hour. So yeah, that's all for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll be back soon with a brand new video for you all. Until then, you stay atomic. And I'll see you all next time. Bye!